Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Donna here. Uh, this afternoon we're going to have a short tour of the decorations that we have completed together, most of them, for fall. And then uh, Monday I'll be back with a new project video. And this afternoon we are hosting a party. Um, so I thought now that the house is clean and the house is set up for the party, it would be a nice time to do the video for the tour. It's just a short and sweet, so sit back and enjoy, and I'll be right back outside. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Um, here's our little bit of a house tour. What's happening today is we're hosting an end-of-the-season uh, party for my husband's golf buddies, and so I thought this would be a good time to show you the decorations. I'm not overly decorated. I'm kind of minimalistic in my decorations, but... They really, uh, we, most of them we made together, so it would be kind of fun to look at them. Uh, this is out front, as you can see, on the lamppost. I'm laughing because it's the end of summer golf league party, and it's 93 right now. But <laughs> it'll be fall sometime, I think around February. Okay, we're going to go up to the front of the house. I'll be right back. Well, now you can see the golf cart. <laughs> and over here, we just have a little bit of a welcome area. And that wreath and the one on the door I made last year. This bow we made together this year. And the sign from the Dollar Tree, welcome to our patch. And the placemats from the Dollar Tree. And then this is the other wreath. Okay, we'll head on inside. Okay, when you come in the door, uh, I think you'll see a few wreaths over here. Um, this is what I call downstairs. You see the stairs here go up into the main part of the house. You'll go up there in a the bit. But just a little, few things out here. These, of course, are the wreaths that we worked on. Thanks, uh, Halloween and Christmas. And the bubble wreath up there. I don't know if you ever saw my golfer. And then, of course, down here, we have it set up for the party. And this is a bar over here. It's the drinking crowd. <laughs> There's the lanterns we put decorations on. And just a few decorations on this little box over here. Nothing elaborate. It's also where we watch football. So I'm going to head upstairs and we'll start in the kitchen. Be right back. Okay, here we are in the kitchen. And we have the table ready for the pate. And our scarecrow centerpiece looks really cute in there now. And over on the wall here we have the fall bubble wreath. The bubble wreaths really lend themselves well to have lights put on them because you can hide the strings in between all the bubbles. And panning around this way. It's the lantern. And then over here, just above the sink, there's 
a sunflower spray. There you go. Now you can see it. My famous clam chowder. <laughs> and that's it. You'll have to excuse the chairs in all directions here. Three-tiered tray. Let's head down the hallway to the guest bathroom. And there's the candle that we just did. And it's going to come on automatically at 4, so I didn't bother to turn it on now. And this little wreath is really up all year round. I love it, so I just leave it there. And we have some pumpkins and a little floral arrangement. And a few sunflowers up at the top of the mirror. And my tissue box is decorated for Halloween. I have a video somewhere along in the line that shows you how to make these for whatever season you want. If I can find it, I'll link it below, but it's a, quite an old one. All right, let's head back out. And into the living room. And just a few decorations around in here. This is a candle ring that we made last year. Some pumpkins over by the TV. And this is the candle ring we made this year. Okay, let's head out to the family room. We have our table with a lantern. Again, that lantern's coming on about an hour, so I didn't want to disrupt my timer. And it's so bright out here, it probably wouldn't show up anyway. And then on this table, we have the centerpiece we made this year with the little scarecrow sitting in it. And I picked up some of these pretty fall plates from the Dollar Tree. And then over there, is the baker's rack. And I already did a tour of the baker's rack, so I'm not going to go shelf by shelf. And last but not least, we have our pretty multicolored fall wreath that we made. And it fits really nice in here. And I'm back around to the other door that goes back downstairs where we started. So that's the tour, short and sweet. Now I've got to get ready for the crowd to arrive. There'll be about 30 people. Looks through. Looks pretty through the window to see all those decorations. So that's it. Um, and I'll be back probably Monday with the next project video. And it'll be a wreath. I'm not sure what kind yet. Christmas, I believe. So that's all for the tour today.
Hope you enjoy the rest of your afternoon. And until we meet again, everybody play nice now. Bye-bye.